guys, welcome to another episode of Cranes Comics. It has been a minute since I've been on YouTube. So what is going on guys? What's new with you? What's new with me? I'm about to show you. So stay tuned and we'll jump right into this video. Hey guys, alright, so uh, I kind of want to go over a couple things for you. I've not been real consistent with my channel. I do apologize about that and hopefully... Uh, hopefully everything is going well for you guys. I miss interacting with you guys. I miss putting out videos. I don't miss the work that's involved, but I do, 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 like doing this and I do like making videos. I like showing you guys what I get, things that peeve me about the comic community world and things that I actually really enjoy. So let's jump right into this. First, I want to go over my figs. Uh, lately I've been getting a few figs here and there. I might put a couple up on eBay, just, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I do like them, but some of them I just get just to get. So, uh, without further ado, this was one I'll probably not put up on eBay, but I got Mysterio. I don't know if you guys are familiar with his character, but he is one of Spider-Man's arch nemesis. Um, you can see the Spider-Man logo there and my box is bent. I did not know my box was bent right there. Anyway, this is one of uh, Spider-Man's arch nemesis. I think this figure is amazing looking. It's one of the coolest figures in this set, in my opinion. And uh, I don't know if you can tell, but right there, you can build Lizard Man or Lizard or whatever you want to call him. Uh, he looks super dope. Like, I'm not going to lie. And this comes with one of his legs, and he just looks really dope. I would not mind building the figure, but I do not want to hunt down every single one of these. This guy was a pain in the butt. I actually had to pre-order him on GameStop, and we all know that GameStop overcharges for figures, but this guy just, I couldn't pass up. I really like him. He's cool, and I might actually display him. Might take him out and display him, so that's kind of cool. There's again another look at the figure. Back to the box. Side of the box, you got Mysterio there. So, pretty cool guy. Next figure up, I got the Iron Spider from the Avengers new movie that was not out yet. So this is one of the cooler Spider-Man figures, I will have to say. He doesn't come with anything. He literally just comes with uh, Thanos' leg here, and that is it. So on this side you got Spider-Man, this side you got Spider-Man, and then you got a full picture of Iron Spider-Man on the back, and you have a picture of Thanos right there of the figure that you're going to be able to build. Cool, cool uh, figure. He is a little fragile, um, but the detailing, I will say, I don't know if you can see through the packaging, but the detailing on this figure is pretty incredible. Uh, but from what I hear, a very, very fragile character. So I'm not sure if I'm even going to open that. Captain America. Um, I got him. My buddy found him at a Best Buy for me. He is a little sliced up and sliced open, but it's super cool. This is definitely a figure I want to hold on to. He's kind of sliced up right there, too. Uh just the whole package is phenomenal i love this suit i love that he doesn't have like a really like super superstar i guess you could say on his chest it's kind of blended it just looks great the belt looks really good i'm really excited to open this guy up this one does come with thanos's head right there but i mean super awesome figure and great detail on the figure itself there's uh captain america up front you got a picture of Cap there, a picture of Cap there. Uh, does come with Thanos' head down here, and there's the back of the box. It shows all the different figures down there. And you got the nice little A for Avengers. Assemble. For either Avengers or Assemble, either one. Next up, we got Thanos himself. This guy is a beast. This is one of the ones I'm probably going to throw up on eBay. Um, he is a Walmart exclusive. Uh, this is not the one that you build. This is just a completely different one. Um, he is a beast to hold. He is really beefy and really heavy. You have a picture of Thanos on both sides of the box. You have a pretty sick Infinity Gauntlet like picture right there. Overall, a pretty sick, pretty sick figure. Um, I would say that the detail could be a little bit better on the figure himself. He's got this nice royal blue going on, which I'm kind of digging. I really like that a lot, actually. He's he's pretty cool. Interchangeable heads. Uh, you can get them smiling or not smiling. What 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 have you? What have you? But anyway, pretty cool little figure. But like I said, I might throw this guy up. I'm not a huge Thanos fan. Only reason I got him was because he's hard to find. That's honestly that's pretty much it. So 
other than that, I want to go over some books. Uh, there's a nice little mom and pop shop that was closing down. Um, I got this bad boy, this little box. I don't know if you can see. It's normally like a $10 box. I got it for three bucks, which is pretty cool. Uh, there, is, there was like some tape or something on it. Um, but yeah, there was some tape or something on it, but that's, that's not a big deal. But anyway, I'm going to end... I'm gonna end my haul there guys. I do want to have a quick little combo with you if you just stick to the end of the video I'd highly appreciate it, but if uh, I kind of I, I miss you guys. I miss doing this. I miss Being here for you and I miss having that interaction with you guys. So I mean Please leave me comments leave me any any kind of feedback down below and I'll be more than happy to get back to you um, I like the interaction with people. I've met some really good friends through YouTube. Just, I'll just name a couple offhand. Uh, Britton and Alyssa, I've talked to Britton a few times. They've sent me stuff, I've sent them stuff, it's great. Um, there was a gentleman named KC the Comic Geek, or JC the Comic Geek, and I haven't spoke to him in a while. Like it's been a hot minute, and he's kind of shifted from uh, comics to games, which is more power to you. He's still doing what he loves to do. Uh, he doesn't, I don't think he's in the YouTube community as much, but awesome guy so I miss this kind of interaction and I miss the support and love from you guys basically so uh, I will get together a room tour pretty soon for you uh, just because I mean it's been a while since I've showed off my my awesome room and I just I would like to do that like I would like to show you guys what I uh, what I come home to and what I like to critique here or there so Thanks guys for watching. As always, love each other with comic books. Leave a comment, question, anything down below. Be more than happy to answer whatever you guys ask. So thanks for watching. Have a great day.